been asking for it. Social media has been asking for it. TNT and the AW Women's Division, not so much. Sheeta, I heard you, and I heard you really well. So if you don't know me, let me introduce myself. Women's World Champion, Thunder Rosa from the NWA. I come here to help you, no, to help me, to bring the women's division to the next level, to actually put it on the map and get some respect that we deserve. So on the pay-per-view, I don't come here just for scraps. I come here for your championship. So at All Out Cheetah, I have a request. Omaino, Beretoga, Hoshi. So you can understand me. And for all those that speak English and Spanish, vengo por el campeonato. I am here for this championship and nothing else. We're back live here on TNT. One of the most fundamentally sound matches we've seen in a long, long time between Thunder Rosa and Serena Deep. It's physical, and look at this. Boom! During the break, Thunder Rosa charging into the corner. That drop kick to the midsection, knocking the wind out of Serena Deeb. I like how she extended the legs for some extra power on that drop kick. Well done. During our break, uh, Excalibur is explaining to us that he thinks that that uh, Thunder Rosa is a stylistic nightmare for the AEW Women's Champion. Yeah, that's right, Jr. She has uh, she can match. Hikaru Shida, strike for strike. She has the uh, the Lucha Libre influence, a, a style that is uh, that is unfamiliar for Hikaru Shida. And so, in a, in so many different ways, she is a puzzle for the AEW Women's World Champion, Hikaru Shida. Serena Deep finding her way back up oh. to a vertical base. Got a backstabber in on the NWA Women's Champ. And you know that Hikaru Shida is watching this matchup closely, scouting the competition. Oh. This line's there from deep, taking Thunder Rosa off her feet. Remind the fans of Dark comes your way on our YouTube channel each and every Tuesday. And here are some of the results from yesterday. And, and look at this. Almost, uh, oh, no, Thunder Rosa transitions, or excuse me, Roll deep up. transitions into a pinning predicament. Thunder Rosa very nearly got caught sleeping. That was a smart move to get to the corner, though, after that. And she got the, the elbow oh. up. Mistake there by Serena. Got a little overzealous. Oh, and she... quickly, which is a key term, quickly followed up by Thunder Rosa, the NWA women's champ, nope. now building some momentum. Those knees so dangerous by Thunder Rosa, and that's the striking I was talking about. Oh, another one of those drop kicks. Yes, sir. Low, sudden, and powerful. Yes, sir. Extending the legs out as she connects. Look at there. Here's a shoulders down. Now, aggressive cover there, high stack on it. Well, these ladies are pushing it, aren't they? Yes, I'll, this is a, one of the better female matches, and that's probably getting me in trouble. No, well, I, no, you, I, I understand. It's, it's, it's we've had. Yeah, it's been a, it's been a, you can't and, deny it's been a great match. And we've had a lot of good ones. Yes, we have. And Thunder, oh no, look at that! Deep counters, two, no. Oh, wow, that was almost a major upset. I'll tell you what, a match this challenging, this uh, daunting for Thunder Rosa may. Do her good for Saturday night, too. Oh, the arms of Thunder Rosa are Look captured. Deep looking for that pile driver, but Thunder Rosa hoists her up. Down Valley driver. Wow. Got a lot of head there. And the neck cover. And Deep somehow kicks out. Hey, look, Serena can, can earn a job here. This is serious business, ladies and gentlemen. You seen the unemployment race lately? Yes, we have. Deep gets that shoulder up. Off the canvas. Oh, look at oh, that. Look at Roll that. in. Thunder Rosa, one counter. Neither one wanting to give way. Wild swing and a miss there. Oh. Oh. Open hands, yeah. shots, palm strikes, suplex. Dee D would really put herself in line to, to buy for the NWA championship as well with a win. You're right. But right now, it doesn't look good for Serena. She's with weathered the storm on more than one occasion in this match against her amazingly talented opponent, Thunder Rosa. Look at that strength. Thunder Rosa hoists her up. Oh, the Thunder Driver! One, two, three! The winner of this match, the NWA World Women's Champion, Thunder Rosa. Thunder Rosa proudly wants to display her NWA Women's title. 
But she's got a chance to go even beyond that, at least in our estimation, by, by becoming the AEW Women's Champion. But well, she's got quite an attitude as well. And she's going to need it come Saturday night against Cheetah. As uh, Excalibur says, she's got that great MMA background. And that striking background will serve her well. Walking into Saturday night, the AEW Women's World Championship will be on the line at All Out. She prays at uh, America Top Team in, uh, San, in San Antonio. If you think you are strong enough, tough enough, and you think you have enough passion, show me. I'm waiting. I first saw Thunder Rosa in Staten Island at an event, and I remember thinking, this girl is one of the most talented female wrestlers I've ever seen in my life. Women's World Champion, Thunder Rosa from the NWA. I come here to bring the women's division to the next level. For Thunder Rosa, this is an incredible opportunity to be seen on the world stage. For those fans who maybe don't know her that well, prepare to be surprised by her charisma and her love of the sport. She absolutely loves a good fight and is a born champion. History has been made, Thunder Rosa, the first Mexican-born NWA World Women's Champion. What a predicament would happen with the uh, possibility of Thunder Rosa becoming a dual champion, AEW and NWA. That's a big if. Pro wrestling is what Sheeta was put on earth to do. When I was first approached by AEW management about the opportunity of our champion, Thunder Rosa facing their champion, Sheeta, well, I was all for it. For I believe all champions should be fighting champions. And I certainly appreciate this opportunity for our two promotions to work together. I am here for this championship and nothing else. Hi, I'm Mega. I'm Chief Legal Officer for AEW, and we're here tonight to finalize the contract for the AEW Women's World Championship title match on September 5th at All Out. This. No. Boy, a Sheeta up on the shoulder. Sheeta fights free. Sheeta a little bit bigger. Yeah. Strength in her legs helped her right there to get out of that predicament. Oh, the roundhouse caught. Sheeta, if she could sweep out that, that far leg, she's got her Sheeta. almost in the stretch muffler, but uh oh no. Countered. Really a, a beautiful veteran counter by Thunder Rosa. And, and that's that Lucha Libre influence there from Thunder Rosa. Both women meet center of the ring. Oh, the jumping knee strike. We talked about the knee strikes a few minutes ago, and all of a sudden, Sheeta pulls it right out of her pocket. Yeah, she's got an opening. Let's see if she can follow up with something, but that back is still bothering her. She is AEW's first female 30 match winner. She has had an incredible career in this company. And as we are growing, so is she as a talent and an athlete. Patience, folks. Thunder Rosa. Oh! Kicked her legs, but Sheeta just muscled her up, hit her with the suplex, hooks the far leg. It didn't seem like Sheeta quite got control of the leg as she wanted. That shot right there is a Hooks the far leg again. Two. That Two may come. have been more glancing than we thought. Yeah. Because a clean shot by Sheeta with that puts you down. Yeah, Sheeta loves to employ that Tamashi, that running knee strike finisher. She's got her. Thunder Rosa hooked up. She went for that, that Falcon Arrow, but Thunder Rosa counters. Two. No. Well, that was an unorthodox exchange and an interval there. But the bottom line, as an old friend of mine used to say, is that she turned her on her, at the end, she got her on her back. Yeah, that's right. Thunder Rosa found herself in control of Hikaru Shida's back and put her in that, uh, that submission attempt. As you see, we're trending number one worldwide. Thank you for being with us. And we are seeing quite a quite a battle here between these two women. Oh, man. Leaping clothesline in the corner. We saw this on Wednesday night. Still impressed with it. Yes. Look at that. She's a great striker. Right into the collarbones. Double knees there from Thunder Rosa. There are two collarbones, aren't there? Yes, there are. Clavicles. Oh! Leaping drop kick from Thunder Rosa sends Hikaru Shida out to the stage. Physical matchup. And I, and I think the physicality really benefits Thunder Rosa. Rosa 
with Sheeta up. Look out. She's looking maybe for a Death Valley driver. Look out here. Death Valley driver on that on the entranceway. Thunder Rosa goes face first to the turnbuckle. And Hikaru Shida picking picking Thunder Rosa up to the top. Now this is dangerous for both ladies. I tell you, just a shove either way, and somebody's going to fall off onto the floor. This, oh, this is dangerous. Yeah, it is. What the hell? Are they? They're trying to, each are trying to jockey for position. Yeah. Obviously, if somebody's back was to the mat, uh, it would be a little uh, bit better. Uh, oh no, 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 no. Thunder Rosa with Hikaru Shida up on her shoulders. She just got to hold the second rope. Can oh. she hold it? No, no, she can't hold it. Death Valley driver on the apron. Again, we talked earlier about how dangerous anything is that's executed on uh, the, the ring apron. It's hard. It's the, there's more padding in the middle of the ring. Now she's going to roll her to the center, try to get the win. Two, no. Wow. That was close. Boy, Sheeta's got a long way to come back from, I tell you. Turner's done a good job refereeing this match, I think. Yeah, Paul Turner has, I agree. And there we see Thunder Rosa with the arms of Sheeta captured. And now look at that. She, she locks it off on the. She's wow. really, yeah, stretching the shoulder, the arm, the elbow, like every part of that right arm. So you can read about it tomorrow. The deal is, is that the headline could say the NWA champion makes the AEW Women's Champion submit. That's a headline. Sheeta gets her boot on the bottom rope to force the break. We want to remind fans that AEW Dynamite returns here to Daly's Place this Wednesday, September 9th. Showtime's at 7.30 p.m. Tickets are on sale right now. AEWTix.com. Nothing like being live here. Oh! We have, in Jacksonville. We have a great time. You're right, Excalibur, on our home court. Great hospitality. Love to see you, folks. Wednesday night. You won't regret it. A little bit of a low bridge there by Hikaru Shida. Yeah. She's up on, on the middle rope. And Thunder Rosa. Oh, the oh, Meteora! That's that influence of Shima on Hikaru Shida. I'm not so sure if the back of her head hit that uh, bottom step or not, but that was close. We'll take a look again. Maybe we can find out. Wow, look at this. Boom! Oh, oh just look. barely oh, missed it. You're right. Close enough to scare the hell out of me. Yeah, you're not kidding. Think about this. You know, you talked about the headline. If Thunder Rosa wins this, she could, in, in effect, unify titles. She could become the biggest woman's wrestling star in the world. I mean, this is what she's wrestling for. She may be one big win next time away from achieving just that. Yeah, becoming the triple champion. That would be a huge thing in, I mean, not just women's wrestling, in all of professional wrestling. Yes, it would. Whoa, look, look at this. This a, wow, body shot. Rapid shots, fire yeah. shot. Oh, yeah. just knee to the, to the midsection. Thunder Rosa is showing her superior striking skill. Oh! oh, that knee. Strong woman, strong legs, suplex down, but. Released German suplex there by Thunder Rosa. Neither woman. Oh! She decides went directly to the eyes of Thunder Rosa after she was thrown. And now Sheeta, the Falcon Arrow! She hooks the legs. Whoa, kick out at one. Veteran kick out. Did Thunder Rosa did not allow the champion, Sheeta, to hook the legs. And Hikaru Sheeta is shook. Yeah, she's shook. She's, she's surprised, shocked, whatever you want to say she is. Falcon, oh, no, oh. Roll, roll up. One, two, whoa. And unfortunately, for Thunder Rosa, she couldn't get back up. And, and now she's paying for it. She's looking for that stretch muffler. And Thunder Rosa trying to claw, crawl for the ropes. Hikaru Shida steps over. Got to hook the body. There you go. Hook the arms. Keep it from sliding off. She's trying to capture the arms. She was looking for full metal muffler. That's when she, she captures the arms. But Thunder Rosa knew that and made it to that bottom rope to force the break. Right. Well, there's, there's the striking you were talking about. Oh, yeah. Wow. Backstabber. And she tracks the combinations. There's a cover. And those combinations are on display show that she has great skill and training. She's not a one-punch pony. What a tough physical matchup this is here. And we expect nothing less when the AEW Women's World Championship is on the line. And the Reynera applied there by Thunder Rosa. 
Spinning the world champion around, but oh, look at this, Sheeta rolls her up. Oh, but the veteran Thunder Rosa rolls right off her own shoulder. That's right. Really smart, now here we go. Cover, legs hooked. And another near fall created by the AEW Women's Champion. Two consecutive elbow strikes very nearly won the day for Hikaru Shida. Hikaru Shida back in the driver's oh. seat. What a backbreaker. Hooks the near leg. Two. Oh! She actually gathered up both legs, but Thunder Rosa still able to kick out. But one can feel the momentum starting to change. The tide starting to turn. Yeah, for the first time ever, really, in this match. Hikaru Shida. Oh, the Tomashi! Covers one, two, three! No winner of this match. And still, AEW Women's World Champion, Hikaru Shida. Great match. Really a great match, folks. Hope you enjoyed it as much as we did, because these two ladies gave us everything they had, two high skill sets, different styles. They're both still evolving as pros, and I love their future. And that lightning-like knee strike, that's all it took, one shot directly to the jaw of Thunder Rosa, put her out, and Hikaru Shida successfully defends the AEW Women's World Championship here tonight at All Out. That's Rebel, Reba, uh, Rebel. And then look from behind. Oh, Britt Baker. What the hell? Oh, my God. What's going on? She wiped her out. Britt Baker just planted Thunder Rosa on the, and, and Rubble has Aubrey Edwards' attention diverted. Referee's attention diverted, and uh, Dr. Baker making the quick exit. Reba was a distraction. Boy, was she what ever. What a plan this was. And Britt, she wiped her out. Britt Baker coming in here like a snake in the grass. You know what? And, oh, the power bomb. Oh, high stack. The One, two, no. The referee and the champion have no clue of what has transpired here. At least by uh, uh, on a sight. Uh, Serena has no idea, but I think Thunder Rosa has plenty of idea what happened. And if, in fact, she can continue here, it's amazing. She got out of that. Thunder Rosa kicking out of that huge power bomb on instinct alone. Hey, that may be an omen, gentlemen. That may be an omen because she kicked out all that after what Dr. Baker did as well on the outside. This may be Thunder oh, Rosa's knife. Jack knife here. Roll up. Thunder Rosa trying to put a quick end to it, but Serena Deep not out of this fight yet. Thunder Rosa has Deep up, Deep rolls through. Oh, Thunder Rosa sits down. One, two. Reversal. Two. No, Thunder Rosa sits out again. Oh, look, oh, at, look at this. Serena Deeb has the arms captured, cranking the neck of the challenger. Looking for the submission. Not tapped out yet. She is punishing Thunder Rosa. Thunder Rosa escapes deep. Rolls through. Oh, the stop to the midsection. A double stomp right to the guts. And that has bought the challenger a bit of time to recover, but she cannot afford to spend much more than that. She was wiped out by Dr. Baker. You know, those two had a war of words on Twitter, and you can see what it has expired, and those two have a problem with each other. Oh, Look at what? this. Two. Serena D was looking for that serenity lock, but instead, Thunder Rosa is able to counter it. Ooh. Man, they are firing with everything they got right now. Oh! Spinning back fist from Thunder Rosa. Oh! Man, that'll take the air right out of you. We got, got a new to. champion. One, two. Shoulder. Oh! It was a great move, but it was not that good of a cover. Man, but it was a near fall and a half, let me was, tell you. It was tremendous. Was close. Thunder. Oh, Thunder Rosa gets rolled up. One, two. No deep. Back and forth they go. These counters after counter. Both women separate. Thunder Rosa thinking backslide here. Serena Deep changes position, flips Thunder Rosa through. She has the arms captured. Oh! Plants the challenger. And Serena Deep victorious. Man, what a man. Of this match. And still, NWA Women's World Champion, Serena Deep. These amazing athletes really turned it loose for us tonight, folks. Even with Dr. Britt Baker's interference and her personal, apparently, vendetta that we've seen online on Twitter, 
kind of stole the spotlight for the champion and the chowder both. It, 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 uh, uh, but she came back at Thunder Rosa from that. And that I, didn't lead to the pin. I think when Serena Deep watches this back, when she finds out what happens, she is going to be upset. She locked in that Swiss special. She put away Thunder Rosa and retained the title, but Thunder Rosa. Thunder Rosa deserved better. She didn't deserve to be assaulted in the middle of a title match for the world championship. That will not be easily forgotten, I would assume. Oh, oh. oh man, what a shot. And Brits, Brits out at ringside. How brazen can you get? Did she think, did the doctor think there wouldn't be a house call on the other side that this woman's going to forgive and forget this quickly? And Thunder Rosa is just the, the referee corps coming to the ring trying to restrain Thunder Rosa, but she is laying in shots on Dr. Britt Baker. They were covering up, trying to protect herself. Boy, Dr. Becker thinks she's the baddest bitch on the block. Oh, watch it, they're not done! My God, look at this! Man, those clubbing blows on both sides. Dr. Britt Baker not taking kindly to Thunder Rosa's war of words, escalating the stakes, but Thunder Rosa not taking it laying down. They're not done yet! Thunder Rosa. Maybe it's going to take more than one of you guys. To... Oh, man. The referee's getting this under control. Thunder Rosa with a switch sling oh. blade. And Brett Baker thrust kick to the face. Thunder Rosa may be out. There's a cover. And the far leg was hooked to no avail. But nonetheless, Dr. Baker has found herself back in control of this one-on-one -on -one matchup. Britt did a great job of making sure that Thunder Rosa stayed down. A series of moves that time. It also gave Baker a chance to maybe catch a breath here as her opponent is down on the mat. But you know, I'll tell you, Tone, Thunder Rosa is such a veteran. Yeah, She's man. been through a lot of wars. The longer you let her hang around, your chances to win lessen. I really believe that. Thunder Rosa looking for the fire thunder, thunder driver, but Britt counters out, lands on her feet. That's just great strength, core strength by Britt Baker. Rosa. Britt, oh no, Britt Baker. Look out. This thunder Rosa. Oh, oh, the air raid crash. That could do it. That should Number do one, it. two, no. Long two count, to say the least there. Now it's a matter of focus. Can the doctor get back to business? And Rebel providing the glove. She is going for the lock jaw right now. But Britt, you can see the damage done to that right hand. She's tr having trouble getting the glove on. Yeah, but she's got her in the right position. Good Lord. What an opportun opportunist. Britt Baker. Got to take him when you can. Look, look at her fighting her off here. That's good strategy. She's got Rosa hooked, but you can see Thunder Rosa maneuvering her oh. legs and gets the boot on the bottom rope to force the break. Thunder Rosa gets out of bounds, got to have a break, which we, we haven't had cover yet. Cover here, one, two. Tell you what, we've been waiting for this match for a long time. It's living up to the hype, guys. These two girls are putting it out, man. They are going full bore. Britt Baker, oh, the, just a running stump driving Thunder Rosa face first into the canvas. She's got it. Britt no. rolls her over. Watch out. Crucifix, up. one, two, no. Rosa oh, kicks man. out right into the lockjaw. Here we go. She's oh, what a sequence of offense and counters. And back to the offense. She's got her pin. And back to a counter. Rosa countered, and Britt's still fighting for that lockjaw. Boy, Rosa's done her homework here, hasn't she? She's got a counter for it. Britt, They're, these were mat wrestling, to say the least. Wow, man. Britt not wanting to relinquish control, but that could be her undoing here. Well, oh, that was timely. Back suplex. Very effective when you nail it. Death Valley driver center of the ring this time. Yeah, second one of the night. She's got her covered. Two, no! Oh, wow, had a pretty good penny wow. combination. She thought she had it. Yeah, I did too. Yeah, second DVD, almost got it. You have to imagine whichever woman comes away with the victory here tonight would be a favorite in the upcoming AEW Women's World Championship title eliminator tournament. Look at, what is, what is Rebel do? Rebel's just ripped off the, the turnbuckle pad. The ref referee's vision was, was obscured. 
Fritz rolled her up on two. No. What was that all about? Insanity is what it's well, about. Well, I, I guess that's uh, that's the only thing you can. Uh, well, you know what happened? It got Thunder Rosa to relinquish the submission. Yes, it did. Yes, and there it was. Got her to relinquish it. Mystery solved. Mystery solved. Thunder Rosa with Britt up on her shoulders. You can see Britt bicycling those legs. Both women backed into the corner. <laughs> exposed steel, as you can see, right at the lower back of Dr. Baker. The second rope has been exposed. Thunder Rosa and, and the referee have no idea what's going Starting on here. Again. And oh, oh, right in the head. Right in the head. Thunder Rosa sent face first in that exposed Thunder turnbuckle. Rosa, I think she's out. Thunder Rosa just went limp. Hey, ref, you really are serious now to check this out here. Come on, she is out, man. She, oh, come on, she doesn't need to do that. The girl's out. The, she can't defend herself. Well, the referee the, just stopped the match. Well, she's unconscious. Doctor she didn't Brent give up. Baker, D Thunder Rosa did not give up. D not at all. And it was the exposed steel that turned the tide of this. And what was it? A tremendous, really stalemate, you have to say, between the two women leading up to that moment. Well, when you think about it, that's a pretty slick plan. Oh, absolutely it is. Now, okay. I'm like really up to my limit. And you know, I'm a very, very patient person. Oh! Oh, oh man, what a shot. And Brits, Brits out at ringside. How brazen can you get? Thunder Rosa doesn't belong here. And as the face of the women's division, it's my job to keep it clean around here. You're not welcome here. You don't belong here. Ah! Get off. Oh, God. God. Oh. What have we got under there? Oh. What have we got? Oh. Oh. What have we got? Oh. Oh. And so you ask me now why I'm beating your ass? Maybe because I really do belong here in AEW. A lot of bad blood between these two women. Now for the first time ever squaring off here at Beach Break. Absolutely ridiculous that I have to spend another second of my time making this riffraff relevant. There's no limits for the hate that I feel for you. I'm tired of you making fun of me, of you treating me the way that you treat me. Paint your whole face, Thunder Rosa. We're sick of looking at it. It's my payback. See here, ladies and gentlemen, the first ever lights out match in AEW history, and these two ladies are headlining. Oh my God! The suplex onto the steel. The steel don't care, but Thunder Rosa's fine certainly does. And Britt Baker's as well. That that hurt both women. Cover here. Two. No. God. It Let's take a look at it again. My God, look at the extension she got on that suplex. Yeah, no way to break your fall. It's stealing that canvas. And, well, oh, there look, you go. Is Rebel pulling the ladder out? Oh, boy, has she been active in this one or what? Thunder Rosa, though, getting up to her feet. She's battered and bloodied, but oh! oh! She just drove the face of Dr. Britt Baker into that ladder. It's been brutal between these here two. Go, here we go, here we go. Here. Brutal between these two for so long that I never thought it would come to this brutality between these two. Thunder Rosa, I must I think her bleeding has stopped, at least has stopped pouring off. And Tony, remember, she it was just about a year ago that Dr. Britt Baker's nose was broken by that woman, the AEW World Champion, Absolutely. Hikaru Shida. Then Britt required facial surgery to to fix that, and Thunder Rosa could be sending her back to the operating table. She's had a broken leg Watch as this. well. Here comes a, oh, a ladder as a weapon. Legal oh. as it can oh, be. No. God. As legal as a headlock. Britt Baker sandwiched in between the ladder. Oh, God. She better duck. Oh, hell. Oh, oh good God. That oh. prop kick. Throw the ladder right into the face. Right into her of face. Dr. Britt Baker. Oh my God. And Thunder Rosa, they're going to do it again. 
She's going to do it. Oh, no! Oh! The ladder driven into the face of Britt Baker, courtesy of Thunder Rosa. Uh, uh, Britt Brit got, her, got her hands up. That's all she could do that time. But I, I think the edge of that ladder still went into the throat. Now Thunder Rosa on the outside. Oh, man. There's already one table set up on the opposite oh, side of the ring. And that's Britt who's bleeding now. Oh, my God. Britt. Thunder Rosa, get the table. Oh, my God. It, this is beyond anything that, that I ever expected in this match. I never dreamed. That, look, she, the blood is pouring out of her head I here. I never would uh, dream what we're seeing. The, the ladder cut her head, and now... It could have been that. I think it might have actually started with that face buster on the ladder and then exacerbated by the drop kick. And, and Rebel's throwing a conniption here. This is not going to be a match we will soon forget, if ever. The first ever oh unsanctioned lights out match on Dynamite. Oh, strikes. We're not going to have a winner. We're going to have a survivor of this damn thing. Strike after strike. And Baker still trying to fight back. Create a little distance, but we'll see how lucky she is in doing that. And Tony Thunder Rosa, so smart, so cerebral, even in a situation like this, she hit Britt in the hip with that, that chair earlier and was concentrating those strikes on that same hip. Uh, Britt just trying to get her balance here. She's lost a lot of blood in a short period. Oh, oh my, God. my God. Thunder Rosa biting that cut. Oh, ho, ho. how about that comeback? Able to extend the leg. Nicely done on a super kick. The thrust kick by Dr. Britt Baker, now Thunder Rosa. Oh, oh flatlined oh. into the ladder. Uh, Thunder Rosa's eyes rolled back in her head. Whoa. Both women covered in oh blood. Oh, my God. Look at Britt Baker. She is struggling to her feet. I, I'm, I'm sorry. I, I've been a friend of hers for quite a while. I really hate to see this. I hate to see it come to this brutality. But, I mean, this was something of Britt Baker's own doing. She was the one that began bullying Thunder Rosa, saying she did not belong in AEW. Oh! This is a bold move by AEW to, to promote this type of match. Uh, uh, it had to happen. Th this is, so, this, uh, they, this can't be, this, no, 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 hell no. Oh, Thunder Rosa. No, 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 oh, no. good God. Death Valley driver onto the ladder. Uh, that had to break a shoulder blade, had to break a back. Oh, and uh, uh, Britt Baker trying to wipe the blood out of her eyes. And Thunder Rosa pulling Britt towards center. No She's looking for a pin here. Pain. One, oh, wow. two. No, Britt kicks out. After having her spine crushed into that ladder, Britt Baker still able to fight and fight and kick out, oh, survive. Look at the pain on both of the ladies' face here. And, and lady is not the, proper, not the proper word right now, but... These are two women, these are two warriors yes, doing battle here in our main event tonight. Two of the best, two of the great athletes we have in AEW. Making a lot of people very proud and honor their effort, no matter who wins this match. I agree, man. Oh, big right hand to the body. This is this is, I, this is setting the standard, man, for, this is a, I, I don't know what to say. Oh, no. oh, DDT on the chair. Look at the dent in the seat of that chair. That was Thunder Rosa's head. Driven into it. And Britt, the stomp! Thunder Rosa's gotta be out. Face first into the steel. The leg is up. And Thunder Rosa somehow, some way able to kick out for God's sake. Oh man, look at But look, look at that smile! The rictus on the face of Dr. Britt Baker. Oh man, she she lives for this. Oh, she's going for it. And you can better believe if she puts the lock jaw on this time, guys. She's not going to let go. And if, and if she locks it in, even if, if Thunder Rosa makes it to the ropes, there's no disqualification. There's no rope breaks. Oh. What's this? What? What is this? I have no idea. I, I don't either. Maybe I don't, it, I don't I, want to know. May, I don't, may, maybe it's uh, uh, she going to hit her up. Oh, oh my God! Uh, no, it's uh, no, no. Thumbtacks, thousands of thumbtacks, and they're going to be in somebody's body sooner than later. Look, Don't look, blink. Look at those sharp edges up. Britt Baker. They're going to check her head here and to see if the. 
And Tony, think about this. Think about how much these two women hate one another. They are willing to go to this, these extremes oh to settle this. Thunder Rosa locked it. Oh, the swinging oh. neck breaker oh, avoided. No. Oh no, she got it. Thunder Rosa was thinking of power bomb. Rebel swung with the, oh! Rebel just got cracked on the head with the, the crutch. Thunder Rosa trying to regrouping. Trying oh, to end this thing. Oh, oh, oh. Through the table. Rebel. Rebel got planted on the table. Through the table. Thunder Rosa escaped the Death Valley driver attempt. Britt. No. Oh, oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. One, two. No. Oh, my God. She kicked out with thumbtacks in her back. Thumbtacks. She looked like a pincushion. Oh, a human God. pincushion. Oh. oh. Good God almighty, can oh you believe this? I don't know what to say. I don't know what to... Oh! And then she kicked out of that damn predicament. Have you ever seen two women, two males, two anybody oh. that have fought like this in a lights out match? I'm going to rethink my friendship. I'm never going to piss her off again. Good God. Thunder Rosa. Oh, no, look at this. They're the lock jaw, and they're laying in the thumbtacks. The there's, lock jaw's applied. There's no way. There's no way they can stop it. Oh, but Rosa There's no way they can stop rolled her back into the thumbtacks. She rolled her back into the thumbtacks again. Oh, God. That's, it, that's the only way she could break is roll her into the thumbtacks. When will this madness end for these two women? Britt Baker trying to crawl, crawl out of the thumbtacks to the relative safety of the ropes. There she goes oh! again. Another great thrust kick that time by Pritt. Thunder Rosa. I don't, she did not see that kick coming. No, she didn't. Wow. The, the, the fact that either one of these ladies can stand is, is a, to me, a miracle. Look at this. Pritt was powerbombed into the thumbtacks, and now I think Pritt is thinking powerbomb through the table for Thunder Rosa, but Rosa. Oh, Lord. Thunder Rosa has got Britt hooked over the shoulder. Uh, Britt is fighting. No, she's Oh, no, oh, no. She's not going to do this, is she? Yet? Oh, the fire thunder driver through the table. Both ladies oh. are damaged goods. Thunder Rosa going for the cover, going for the win. Can she? Yes, yeah, she, she can. She does. Thunder Rosa has won this. Amazing, amazing event. The winner of this match, Thunder Rosa. And she breaks down and cries at the end of it. I don't blame her. My God, what they put each other through. Their bodies punctured with thumbtacks. They bled. They've been bruised. They really may never be the same. This was a career-altering match. We knew it was going to be brutal going into this, but it somehow exceeded expectations. Oh, good God. That fire thunder driver through the table. Thunder Rosa, victorious. Good I agree, bloody man. mess, man. Folks, wow, uh, what a night, guys. Absolutely. And don't forget, coming up next, the mummy, the tomb of the Dragon Emperor. I've never seen anything like tonight in my entire career. We'll see you Wednesday night, everybody. Thank you, guys. Good job, Mark. Tony. Also just alluding to the fact that she signed recently a contract to be full time here in AEW. And we're very proud of that signing. Another great get by Tony Khan. I would agree. Thunder Rosa, they're chanting her name. I think it's great news that she is full time with AEW. A multi-year contract signed by the for the number one ranked contender in the women's division. Could we see Thunder Rosa and Dr. Britt Baker? in an AEW Women's World Championship title match, Tony. We could. I don't know why not, fellas. We've seen them in a lights out match. Hey, we also want to say that coming up Tuesday, the 100th episode of AEW Dark. How about that? Congratulations to you for hanging with Taz for 100 episodes. 
And we're happy to tell you, Excalibur, you got 100 more to do. That's right. <laughs> Look at that roll up there by Thunder Rosa. Oh, the sweep of the leg, lateral press. Thunder Rosa is so skilled in a variety of disciplines. But uh, young Julia Hart is very athletic, extremely uh, agile. She's, she's young. As the, as the guys say, she's green. But she is really learning on the, on the go. And a tremendous athlete, Julia Hart is. But Thunder Rosa, yeah, using Julia's inexperience against her. Exactly. Waving, clapping to the fans, I get it. But pretty, not here. Pretty smart to get the ropes, get a break, get a restart, if you will. Very important that you don't get too far down, too far behind Thunder Rosa, because she will just beat your ass. How about what we heard from Nick, uh, Nick Gage? I'm telling you, this is going to be a sight tonight, guys. Well, he's got nothing to lose, Tony. Oh he's got nothing to lose. There's just no telling what he's going to try to, so to speak, pull out of his hat, if you will, against Chris Jericho. The deathmatch king, Nick Gage, at the behest of MJF, will be Chris Jericho's labor number two. If Jericho loses tonight, if the Painmaker loses tonight, that's it. He can't get his hands on MJF. And I also got good news for you, fellas. MJF's going to be joining us here at the commentary Oh, day, that's right? wonderful. Oh, Thunder Rosa coming through the ropes. Big clothesline. And Thunder Rosa, oh! Driving those knees into the chest of Julia Hart. You know, I've seen a lot of great athletes, both genders. I don't know if I've ever seen anybody that's just naturally tough and aggressive yeah. as Thunder Rosa. It just comes by to her naturally. She's a fighter. She certainly is. It's Julia Hart finding out firsthand, getting rocked in the corner by Thunder Rosa. And excluding the fact that Julia was in the ropes, there were, there were clean legal balls. Oh, oh, boy. A little overzealous there was Thunder Rosa. I think she hurt her left knee on that as well. Yeah, came up clutching that, that left knee after the yeah. drop kick in the corner. Thunder Rosa on the receiving end of that clothesline by Julia Hart. This could be an upset in the making here. Julia looking for that running bulldog, Thunder Rosa. The ankle pick trips through. Oh, look out. And now the knee bar applied. Thunder ah. Rosa has it cinched in deep. Julia Hart in serious trouble here. Julia's got to get that rope, and she finally does. But look at the Thunder Rosa hang on to that submission just a little bit longer. Trying to send a message to the younger competitor, Thunder Rosa. Who swinging a miss by Julia Hart. Oh, back elbow by. Julia Thunder Rosa, though, hanging on to the waist lock. Oh, wow. She had art on that one. Thunder Rosa now charging in. Oh, oh, oh kick in the corner. She didn't miss that one, guys. Nowhere to go for young Miss Hart. Now Thunder Rosa with Julia. She's got her oh, up. Oh, 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 oh. Got her hooked. Fire Thunder driver. Center of the ring. The leg is hooked. And Thunder Rosa with the win. As, as yeah, impressive as match. ever. Thunder Rosa. You gotta believe, folks, somewhere down the line, she's gonna be a champion. Right here. Yeah, you wanna talk about a classic lights out match, one of the most classic women's matches I've ever seen in my life. Thunder Rosa versus Dr. Britt Baker in a, in a lights out match. Uh, as brutal as it comes to show how, how the, that side of, of what Thunder Rosa can do with or without weapons and barbed wire and tacks, et cetera. And remember, on that night, Thunder Rosa was victorious. She defeated Dr. Britt Baker, DMD. But of course, as we mentioned, the unsanctioned lights out match does not count. It counts to me, Excalibur. Does not count against the record. Oh, spine oh. buster by Mercedes. The cover here, high stack. No. Well, the action will continue in picture in picture. Don't go anywhere. Right now, Martinez has an opportunity that might have opened up here for her on Rosa. Great counter with that spine buster using Thunder Rosa's momentum against her. And now Mercedes Martinez, look at that. Hammering the lungs, the chest of Thunder Rosa. Trapping that arm there. Maybe going for a dragon sleeper possibly here. Once, once again, seeing Mercedes for the first time, I like how methodical she is. She's doing everything with purpose. That's impressive to me. But Thunder Rosa trying to fight off the mat, driving those knees to the side of the head. There is the crown of the head of Mercedes Martinez. 
Mercedes, hoist up Thunder Rosa, Thunder Rosa reverses into the reverse DDT. Hard landing for Martinez. Covers. Thunder Rosa grabs the front chancery. It was there, right? Snatched that head. If you got an opportunity, control the head, you control the body. But Thunder Rosa, she had the, the arm of Mercedes Whoa. Martinez trapped between the body and now allowed Mercedes to hit this delayed vertical suplex. Mercedes showing off her power here. Yeah, great balance and power. I agree with Taz. The power for sure, but it's more the balance and the wherewithal to keep her completely using that symmetry to keep her in the air. Once again, up in the suplex. Now with Thunder Rosa, the ankles on the oh. ropes. Nice. Swinging neck breaker. Far leg is hooked. Great cover there by Mercedes Martinez. Martinez thought she might have captured the win, but she did not. And you can see right now, she's hell bent to put down Thunder Rosa. Now we're seeing a little bit of the 20 year, 21 years of experience that Mercedes has. And she's taking it to Thunder Rosa, controlling the flow. Oh, stunner by Thunder Rosa. And now she's done. <laughs> That's how quickly the time uh, can the change. The time can change. Absolutely. absolutely. And we're touching with someone like Rosa. Running knee strikes in the corner. Thunder Rosa. A war cry Whoa. there. I like it. Leaping drop kick. Mercedes Martinez is in trouble. Thunder Rosa. Yep. Northern Lights suplex. Two counts. Whoa. Great Northern Lights suplex by Thunder Rosa. Welcome back to EW Rampage here on TNT, where we are witnessing a true battle between Mercedes Martinez and Thunder Rosa. Mercedes, yeah, with the fireman's carry on the on the middle rope. She got Thunder Rosa. Oh, oh Avalanche, Death Valley driver. Oh, that might be it. Thunder Rosa in serious here trouble. We go. Mercedes got her hooked. Oh, oh wow. Even Mercedes, Mercedes thought she had her by waving it off at the end, but it was. Not enough to keep Thunder Rosa down. That was one hell of a landing on Rofa Rosa's body right there. And there's never been any question about the toughness of Thunder Rosa, but it is on display right before our eyes uh -oh. here tonight on Rampage. I thought she was going electric chair there, possibly, but look at this. Doing maybe a, a, a Splash Mountain Excalibur. Yeah, BT Bomb. That's, oh, wait, no! Thunder Rosa. Reverses rolled up Mercedes. Oh, a knee to the face. What a knee strike it was. Woof. Thunder Rosa got Mercedes. Fisherman suplex, perhaps? No. Hoister up the fire thunder. No, instead, almost like an emerald fusion. Unique, well done by Rosa. And look at that. Smart Martinez, the veteran, getting out of harm's way. Create some separation. Get out of the way, you hurt. You can't win if your opponent's on the floor. Exactly, Mercedes. Oh, oh my goodness! Just slammed face first into those steel ring steps. The edge of that step could have split her wide open. And you can see the face of Martinez. It looked like she don't even know where the heck she's at. They're, They're both up. just out of it after getting the trap kicked out of them by each other. What has she got? Oh, pipe? what the hell is this? Oh got my! A pipe right there. The Mercedes hell? Martinez. I don't believe it. What the hell? That a disqualification from? in AEW. We never see this. This, this could be the first disqualification I've seen on Rampage ever. Well, we assume. Ladies and gentlemen, the winner of this match as a result of a disqualification, Thunder Rosa. Wow. Mercedes Martinez grabbed that pipe from underneath the ring, and she absolutely clocked Thunder Rosa. Mercedes Martinez. Look out here. With the table set up. Oh, oh the fisherman buster. On the table, the table breaking. A lot of things got busted there, including perhaps the spine, the back, the ribs of Thunder Rosa. Fans here reacting. I think of both ladies there, JR. Yeah, all with you on that time. And I mean, think, think back through the break, we saw both of these women brawling all over the Nashville Municipal Auditorium here. Boy, this place has seen some dandies over the years. Oh, boy, have they ever. You know what? The part of the table broke where Thunder Rosa hit, but not where Martinez hit. So she took the brunt of that. I, I, that's what I'm thinking. And, and you know, seeing that table oh. being introduced in the match reminds me of when Thunder Rosa defeated Dr. Britt Baker, DMD, 
in that unsanctioned lights out match just about a year ago. Good call. Classic matchup between uh, two of the greats. And it was Thunder Rosa putting Britt Baker through the table to score the win. Something that Britt Baker has never forgot. Therefore, that's why you see Mercedes Martinez here now. It's almost like an old school bounty or something. And she really can't trust her. You heard what she said. Oh God, look at this. To her Cobra Kai sensei. She'll break her fall with that trash can. It looks like oh. somebody will. Wait, Thunder Rosa. Oh! Work on Rana. Off the ropes. And now Thunder Rosa with the trash can in hand. Oh, oh God. Right in the it. face. Right in the face with the edge of that opening the trash can. And now the trash can over Mercedes. Head. Thunder Rosa lines her up. Drop kick. That running drop kick right into the trash can that contained Martinez cover. Whoa. Oh, man, bad break for Thunder Rosa because that was a three count. Yeah. Just to those long arms of Mercedes Martinez. Did her some favors. Yeah, there's no way Mercedes was going to be able to endure a drop kick with a trash can wrapped on her head. Thunder Rosa, and both these ladies for that matter, but they, she knows no fear. She's almost challenged to do things like Whoa. that and get herself caught. That trash can lid driven into the throat of Thunder Rosa. Yeah, the edge of it that time, the hard edge of it. Thunder's in the wrong time zone right now. Mercedes Martinez taking advantage of Thunder Rosa, leaving her oh, feet God. voluntarily. Oh, and God. now Spider German suplex. Oh, my God. She was folded up like an accordion was the human anatomy of Thunder Rosa. Now, how in the hell she would be able to continue would be beyond me. Is it even feasible? Is it even possible? Mercedes Martinez perched on the top. Drop on oh, oh. the elbow. Oh, God, and she stumbled and she hit her heart. And the cover to no Thunder Rosa. Inches away from a three count. How in the hell did Thunder Rosa get out of those two things? The just toughness of Thunder Rosa. Real and determination. God, I courage. Watch this Spider German suplex. Oh, God. And then that elbow, just, it was a diving and elbow. Mercedes slipped coming yeah. off on that elbow. And that made it worse. It could, could have been even worse. That now the chairs piled up in Woo. the center of the ring. This is a battle. How tough are these two women? How tough are they, ladies and gentlemen? There's our main event still to come. Mercedes maybe think a power bomb, pile driver perhaps on the chairs. Thunder Rosa has got the crucifix and crucifix oh. bomb. Woo! Thunder Rosa has the upper hand on Mercedes Martinez. You can see the sense of urgency there with Thunder Rosa. Oh, wait a second. Gonna be the final Thunder Driver on the chairs. Look at the intensity etched on the face of Thunder Rosa. Thunder Rosa goes over the pin. The legs are hooked, and she wins. Thunder Rosa shining again. Rosa. It was Mercedes Martinez that introduced the chairs, and it was the chairs that came back to get her. Hoisted by her own petard, Tony. In the last uh, 42 matches, Thunder Rosa's record now is 40 and two. Wow, 40 and two. And you can see the physical toll this battle took on both women. What a hell of a fight. Yeah. Oh, wait, put it out. There's a lot of respect one would assume that these two ladies have developed between each other. They, this is not the first place and the first time that they competed. They're old enemies. Yeah, they, Thunder what? Rosa. What a sign of respect. Man, I'm proud of these women. They have been through hell to get, oh, wait a second. Tony, look at the face. I've seen that look before. That is one pissed off doctor. Britt Baker. I devised the doctor to stay in her lane. Ordered, Britt Baker ordered Mercedes Martinez to come out here. 
to beat Thunder Rosa physically, to pin her, to knock her out of the top five rankings. So now what? I told you she was weak. Now finish her. Baker Sensei. And look at this! Jamie Hayter descending. Hayter and Rebel double teaming. Or Thunder Rosa for. We know the reason. Because this is what the dentist wants. And Britt Baker with that pipe in hand. Is Britt Baker so intimidated and worried about Thunder Rosa that she's going to conduct herself this way? Very unprofessional. Jamie Hayter and Rebel holding Thunder Rosa down. Now, Britt Baker ordering Mercedes Martinez use the pipe, get the revenge, take out. Come do what you're paid to do, in other words. Yeah, but he just said that she was weak. Maybe. Oh! oh! Boy, Jamie Martinez Hader. hesitated too long. Jamie Hayter did not wait. Mercedes, look at Dr. Baker. And, and Britt is on top of Thunder Rosa and Jamie Hayter on Mercedes Martinez. Mercedes, after that crisis of conscience, Jamie Hayter and Britt Baker leave Thunder Rosa and Mercedes Martinez lying. And Thunder Rosa, what a drop kick. It's one of her trademark maneuvers. Thunder Rosa, high stack, goes for the cover. Referee Paul Turner says no. God, Mighty, what's she doing here? Just gouging her forehead. Oh, oh wow. That gut shot into that. But, oh, wait. Thunder Rosa's thinking Fire Thunder Driver maybe on that exposed chair. Ooh, Britt Baker, back elbow. Very right. authoritative back elbow. Oh! Boy, that was a miscalculation. Paul Turner just got rocked by Britt Baker. Right in the nose. And there he goes. Got to hit the cage. Oh, the roll up here. Paul Turner just got rocked with a super kick and then sent into the cage. Here's the Fire Thunder Driver. Fire Thunder Driver. But no referee to count. No referee to count. All that great offense was for naught, at least for now, by the, by the challenger for Britt Baker's title. Well, with the referee down, this is where Britt would really have an advantage if she had Rebel and Jamie Hayter in ringside. But she doesn't, obviously. And big chance, big risk here. Oh, wait a second, Britt is up and cracks under Rosa. Three hard. times with that chair. That's hard, hard shots. Britt Baker going a little strong style there, those stiff chair yeah, shots. She's stiff, man. And Britt piling the ch chairs up in the corner. It's not a little comfortable, comfortable bird's nest. That's a landing pad for somebody, which could very easily end to the end of this match. Uh oh, this this does not look good for Thunder Rosa. Thunder Rosa attempting to get her footing on the ropes, but Britt Baker has Thunder Rosa oh on the second rope. Oh. Avalanche air raid crash out of the chairs. That's got to be it. There's no referee. The still. lower back, the spine. She and said, "Get a rep," and here comes Aubrey Edwards. They've opened the cage for Aubrey Edwards. And now she's going to make the cover. One, two, no! Oh! oh, that close from it being over. Rip Breaker must be saying, what the hell? Is, what have I gotten myself into here? Could have been the time it took to get a new ref helped out Thunder Rosa. It sure as hell didn't hurt her. Could have been. She got a break there. Thank God Aubrey Edwards is here to officiate this thing. And Britt Baker getting in the face of Aubrey Edwards. She, she hates Aubrey Edwards, I know that. And Aubrey will not back down. Yeah, Britt thinks Aubrey's one of the conspirators against Britt's rise here in AEW. 
but Britt Baker. Thunder Rosa has, Thunder Rosa cannot even defend herself here. That's very uneasy. It's not a peaceful, easy feeling, I can promise you. The referee's got to be paying attention to that as well. Britt Baker. And this is quite the housekeeping job. Constructing some sort of. I'm not so sure Thunder Rosa can take two of these after what she took with a pile over on that other turn. This crowd chanting for Thunder Rosa. They love this woman here in San Antonio and around the world. And Britt is looking not only to end the oh night, God. but she is looking to end the career of Thunder Rosa. Well, Britt Beckham brought all these chairs into the ring that were conveniently under the ring. Oh. Just spearing Thunder Rosa. She just told Aubrey to shut up. And she, Britt Baker, may be moments away from shutting up one of her fiercest rivals. Oh, God, look at those chairs. Thunder's trying to find her way out of this thing. No, Both no, ladies no, go to the top. No, no. No man's land. No woman's land. Nobody's land. AEW Women's Championship on the line. And look at these two exchange on the top. A headbutt. The bloody heads cracking together, these two women. Oh, oh God. God! God! The spine of Britt Baker on those unforgiving chairs! The cover, there's a cover! Oh! Man, if that doesn't get it done, you have to kind of wonder, what is it gonna take? Look at this. Oh, oh God. God. No way to learn to fall where you can, oh, well, this is okay. This is easy. It's not easy. Oh, but Thunder Rosa. It's not okay. Just ate a super kick, a desperation super kick from Britt Baker. Britt may have thrown all she had left into that shot. What's she going? Oh, oh wait. Oh, Lord. Harkening back to one year ago. Somebody tell me why we need thumbtacks under the damn ring. Oh! I would think maybe that was a plant by Hater or Rebel. That very well could be, Tony. And at least the thumbtacks are getting a somewhat of a disturbing ovation. Thumbtacks by the hundred inside the ring. Britt Baker looking for that fisherman's neck breaker. No, Thunder Rosa counters out. And Britt drops to one knee. Oh, oh. back body drop onto the thumbtacks. Thumbtacks dotting the body of the champion, who are the challenger, whose shoulders are down. Oh, but Britt goes right into the lockjaw. Thunder Rosa cannot escape. Britt's got the glove on. Well, that was uncalled for. Oh, but oh, buddy. Thunder's biting. It's a hell of a the defense. Champ. But look at those hammer fists to the side of the head. Britt, oh, she floats over. She transitions to the other side. Now looking for Lockjaw. Oh, she's smashing Thunder Rosa's hand onto the tax. That's Britt Becker's hand going into the canvas. And Britt's hand hit the tax as well. Down to one knee, more momentum, but look at this. These two amazing gladiators are loaded with thumbtacks, both of them. They're both bleeding. Grit. God, this is a, a desperation chair to the side of the head. Thunder Rosa, in order to prevent that lockjaw, was smashing Britt's hand down into those tacks. Exactly. And she broke it. This crowd loving this, and we're seeing history being made here tonight in this first ever cage match for the women's title on live television right here on TBS. Oh, oh look out. Thunder oh. Rosa, fire Thunder Driver in the thumbtacks. She got it. New champion, new champion. Thunder Rosa has done it. Here is your winner, and new.
great moment. Thunder Rosa came home, leaving with the richest prize in her game, the AEW Women's Championship. A very emotional Thunder Rosa. Congratulations to her. One hell of a match for the doctor. And all the emotions. Where else you find this? La Mera Mera, the best of the best, Thunder Rosa in her adopted hometown. The new AEW Women's World Champion. Take another look here. All right, it's out, ripped down finally. Throw tax and ball, painful. Look at this. Look at that face. Look at those emotions. Man, what a night, ladies and gents. Tremendous, guys. Tremendous night of action. What a victory. Nyla Rose with Thunder Rosa up. Thunder escapes. Oh, Nyla, oh, just the back of the heel collides with the head of Thunder Rosa. Well, that'll definitely cool off Thunder Rosa for sure. I mean, this, this little bit of offense we saw right there to stop that momentum. Thunder Rosa. Oh, this is patented oh, yeah, Nyla Rose right here, guys. You know what's coming up. <laughs> Thunder Rosa prone on the top rope. Nyla Rose maybe thinking that guillotine knee drop. Oh, yeah, she does it. Nyla Rose does it so damn well. Let's see if she can nail it. Nyla poised to drop the hammer. Nobody. Uh -oh. She Th saw it. Thunder Rosa knew it was coming, and that's the game plan, Taz. Yes, that's right. And I think Nyla took a little long. Oh, boy, got caught again, though, did Thunder. Oh, what strength. Thinking maybe. Oh, my God. Red. Can One, she get her? Two. Can she get her? No. Wow, that was close. Wow, that was tremendous. That was a battle for leverage, a battle that Thunder Rosa won. And it nearly allowed her to retain the AEW Women's World Championship, but she can't quit yet. No, she's awfully upset right now. She's awfully disappointed. She's got to keep it up. Yeah, but Thunder Rosa, she is known for that fire. As you're seeing, she brings the fire. Uh-oh. Oh, but Nyla. The power once again just able to shut down Thunder Rosa. Short arm clothesline into a cover. One, two, no. You know, guys, I'm gonna be honest with you. I think the locks, the hair of Nyla Rose has been getting in her way this match. Yeah, a different hairstyle than yeah. we're used to seeing. Those purple locks have been in her face many times, and when she's able to execute a move, she has to wipe those locks away from her face. And a choke slam by Nyla Rose. And new hairstyle or not, yeah, man. Nyla Rose may be on the verge Which? of becoming a two-time AEW yeah. Women's World Champion. Nyla Rose is zoning in on that right about now. Oh, 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 the boots up. Wait, no. Nyla hoists up Thunder Rosa. Thunder Rosa lands on her feet. Nyla Rose sent into the ropes. Big lariat. One, two, no. Again, showing that toughness and that heart and the fortitude by Thunder Rosa. Thunder Rosa in deep water here tonight in her first attempt to defend the AEW Women's World Championship. Nyla Rose! Oh, God, what a thump. Drives Thunder Rosa! New champ! Oh, no! Man, that was super close. Yeah, let's hear for the perseverance of the champion. That was almost like a jackhammer from that, Nyla Rose. Sickening thud, right? Yeah. yeah. You see the, the eyes of Thunder Rose? I'm not so sure she knows where she is right now. Yeah, well, Nyla Rose knows where she is, though. Yeah. Uh-oh, buddy. Now, this, uh, this doesn't look good for Thunder Rosa. Thunder Rosa with her head underneath the bottom rope on the ring apron. Nyla Rose up to the middle turnbuckle. Oh, my God. And oh, oh. diving sent on, but nobody home. What a nasty landing, crashed and burned. The challenger went. Look at this, roll up, roll up. Nyla in trouble. No, Thunder Rosa, good job of launching off the bottom rope to gain extra momentum to turn the corner on Nyla Rose, but Nyla. Flattens Thunder Rosa. Oh, whoa, 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 two. Whoa. No, again. I'm telling you from experience, all of these kickouts that the champ. Wait, 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 hold on here. Hold on. Cover. No. All of these kickouts that we're seeing, it's more on Thunder Rosa's side. 
I'm telling you, that takes so much energy out of your body. Right, right, right. This late in the match. Right. Where's you out? I got you. Thunder Rosa hook on Rana. He's got the legs hooked. Yes. Oh. The win. Uh, the winner of this match and still AEW Women's World Champion, Thunder Rosa. Thank you for joining us here tonight for Battle of the Belts this Wednesday night, live 8, 7 central on TBS. It's AEW Dynamite. Darby Allen versus Andrade El Idolo in the coffin match. Plus, for the first time ever, CM Punk versus Unnatural Dustin Rhodes. Then next Friday night, Rampage is back at our regularly scheduled time, 10, 9 central on TNT. Eddie Kingston versus Daniel Garcia. Jay Cargill, Marina Shafir for the TBS Championship. Thank you to the proverbial beloved pay window. Yeah, but I'd say you stretch it to four, do as much damage as you can, then you break it. Right thing to do. Now the abdominal stretch locked in. I mentioned Serena Deeb's nine win streak. Two of those victories came over former AEW Women's World Champion Hikaru Shida. So Serena knows what it takes to beat a champion, though obviously the title not on the line there, but on the line tonight, and Thunder Rosa powered out of it. A lot of guts and determination there by Thunder Rosa to power out of that situation. And now look at Serena's gonna get right back into the fray. Regain that momentum she had. It's a game of momentum, especially when you're fighting for championships as we are in this one. Deep again, that uppercut. Thunder Rosa with the chop to the chest. Thunder Rosa backs deep up to the ropes and a big time lariat by Thunder Rosa. Deep wanted to put the brakes on, she could not. Thunder Rosa. The scoop and the slam. The champion with the momentum right now. Now the hammer throw sends Serena deep face first in that middle turnbuckle. Just as you think one of these ladies is beginning to gain a definitive piece of momentum, enough to get a win, it changes. Oh! 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 Wow, both knees well placed. And knees and Thunder Rosa, I believe she can feel the match shifting. The momentum in her court and the drop kick. Thunder Rosa now. Northern Light Suplex. One. Two. She lost her grip on the on the on the takeover side of that uh, Northern Lights. Yeah, and she knows it. If you saw our fantastic countdown special, you saw Thunder Rosa return to the city of her birth, Tijuana, Mexico, as the first Mexican woman to win a major American championship. Very emotional for her, and an emotional victory it would be tonight. But Serena Deeb fighting out, and now with the. Look at maybe for one of those neck breakers once again. Thunder Rosa switch. Champion and challenger switching back and forth. Side rushing load. No, I thought. Oh, the Majigatami. The flying octopus hold. Thunder Rosa has to carry the weight of her opponent as she is being stretched and torn apart. Deep. Releases, counters into, no, not a pin. Instead, maintains control of the ankle. Let's put the brakes on. Yeah, she got both arms up. Stop that one, did Serena. Back elbow caught Thunder Rosa in the face. And now Serena, two! Oh. Oh. Boy, that doesn't get it. One, two, no! What will? I think Serena's thinking the same thing, JR. A little frustration that time. Thinking if that didn't get it, what will? Serena Deeb bringing Thunder Rosa up to her feet. The arms captured behind the back, looking for Deep Talks. Thunder Rosa knows it's coming. You saw Thunder Rosa hand fighting and now Russian leg sweep. Thunder Rosa rolls through. The left arm of Serena Deep captured. Thunder Rosa trying to wrench back, but you see. Deep adjusting her hip position. Shoulders are down. I'm not so sure the ref could see it, but we saw it, and the shoulders were down. The count was accurate. One, two, no. 
Serena D did a great job of transitioning, getting her hips wow. under her, getting off her flat, the flat of her stomach. Look at this. And now Serena looking for the stretch muffler. Oh, you could see, look at Serena wrenching down on the ankle and how that changed the expression of Thunder Rosa. We are seeing the professor at work here, aren't we? No doubt, Tony. Man, the things she can come up with. Oh, look at this. Thunder Rosa smashing the knee of Serena Deeb. This is how Deeb beat Hikaru Shida. Nice up kick there by Serena Deeb. Or maybe some damage done by the world champion. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Tremendous. Crowd loves it here in Las Vegas, showing respect for two ladies that are busting their backsides in a pro wrestling match. Thunder Rosa's lone defense of the AEW World Championship thus far came at Battle of the Belts 2, where she defeated Nyla Rose in the main event. Yeah, much different opponent here, though. Oh, high boot. Serena was charging in. And Thunder Rose. Oh! oh, oh, oh. Yeah. Whoa. Oh, Run the spine. Man. The lower back, the spine. Thunder oh, no. Death Valley driver. Thunder Rosa hooks the far leg. Good grief, she kicked out. Well, back to the drawing board. Let's see what they got left. Class is still in session, Tony. Man, there is. Thunder Rosa doing a great job of keeping her opponent at arm's length the entire time. But oh! That was great. Chop block. Chop block. Followed her in. Get you 15 in the NFL. Look at this. And now the figure four leg lock. And uh, who's closest to the ropes? Not Thunder Rosa. Ooh! Ladies knocking the snot out of each other. At least not. And both women still tied up by the legs and all spilling out of the ring. I don't know who got the worst of that scenario. Could have been either one. Either one. Well, they both kind of hit the same time. If one hit their knee. I don't know. I, it, it, too remember. many uh, appendages to count. Remember, you still have time to get in the AEW DraftKings pool. Download the app. Use promo code AEW when you sign up. And oh, look at that. The dragon screw in the ropes. You still got time to play, Excalibur was saying. Get a chance to win 25 grand tonight on DraftKings. Oh, Deep Tux. Serena oh. Deep is going to do it. She's got the champion covered. Two. No. Look at that stiff. Uh, Placement of the, of the forearm on the face of Thunder Rosa. Yeah, I think she was too worried about the cross face that she was hooking the legs. She was able just to shift her body over was Thunder Rosa to get the ropes. It cost her. But this may be the most trouble we've seen the champion in as Serena Deeb now looking for the serenity lock. That Watson went it with a submission. Does Serena Deeb. And that knee of Thunder Rosa so damaged. There you go. Pull her back to the center. Serena turns Thunder Rosa over. Maybe think of Deep Talks once again. Oh, no, just power bomb. How many? I'm thinking Wardlow here. As many as he wants to give you. Yeah, absolutely. Serena now looking for the clover leaf. Made famous for the great Dean Malenko. A good Te Texas clover leaf, but Thunder Rosa. Yeah, she went she went belly first to counter it. Man, the grit and desire to win in this match is overwhelming. These women are pushing themselves to limits that I'm not so sure I was I was kind of surprised. Yeah, it's a struggle. It's not that only is. a match, it's a struggle. Deep the hands pinned once again. No. Thunder Rosa back body drop countered out. No, Thunder. Or excuse me, Serena Deeb counters. Thunder Rosa sits forward. No. An oh, big high roundhouse kick. Cracked Serena Deeb. And Thunder Rosa charged. Oh. They're, I don't want to say the match is getting sloppy, but we're seeing more chances taken. 
More sense of urgency than unfolding by the heartbeat. I think both competitors trying to throw haymakers, trying to make a hasty end to this matchup. I think you're right. It's because both are spent. And they're so evenly matched. Going for the big one now is Thunder Rosa. Right hands to the ribs. Headbutt. That works. Thunder Rosa gains. It's got to be generally a tough son of a gun to utilize the headbutt effectively and frequently. Here we go. Thunder Rosa gains her footing on the top superplex. Floats over, hangs on. Hey, amigo. And fire Thunder Driver should do it. Oh, what a match. Oh, Tremendous title match. AEW Women's World Champion, Thunder Rosa. A piece of wrestling gold, ladies and gentlemen. Two of the very best in the entire world, no matter the gender. Thunder Rosa, Serena Deep. Put him on a clinic. Tonight was Rose Thunder Rosa's night. What a win for Thunder Rosa. But what do we have in store for him? Yeah, Tony Storm really a globetrotter. Going all over the world, her career has taken her from from Australia to the UK to Japan, now the United States. The snap suplex. Yeah, beautifully done snap suplex. Key with that throw is engage your hips super fast into your opponent's hips as you do a quick back arch. And she did it perfectly. Tony Storm has been a champion all around the world in Germany, Australia, United Kingdom, and in Japan, where she held the World of Stardom title. Of course, Stardom is the it's under the same umbrella as New Japan Pro Wrestling. Sister promotion. Sister well. promotion. That's a good way to put it. Now Storm controlled that front hand like maybe another suplex here. No, maybe not. Oh, Thunder Rosa over this. reverses inside cradle. Cradles are dangerous, guys. Oh! You can get turned real quick on a tilt. You can get pinned, but that slap is ugly. Oof. It's getting ugly. It's getting nasty. Got the sportsmanship going out the window right here. That's your right. Ooh. Ooh. Right in the sternum. Thunder Rosa. Ooh, you can see how red the upper chest area of Tony Storm is from those stinging And this shots. is not where Tony Storm wants to be toe-to-toe -to -toe with Thunder Rosa. A former mixed martial arts fighter, Thunder Rosa. Yeah, no, good point, guys. You know, you don't, and I don't know if you want to play into someone's well, maybe, style off. Maybe it's working, though. Yeah, Tony Storm dropping to, an, or excuse me, Thunder Rosa dropping to one knee. Thunder Rosa put to the midsection, a leaping stunner. Really caught. Tony Storm by surprise there with yeah, that. I think that was the last thing Tony Storm was expecting. Yeah, no doubt. And that's what makes Thunder Rosa so dangerous and so effective as champion. Thunder Rosa driving the knees into the chest of Tony Storm. Storm's in trouble here. Drop kick to the spine. And Kevin. A victory here on this stage in the front oh. of this sold out United Center. Jeez. Would mean so much for Tony Storm, but Thunder Rosa looks to be wrestling Ooh, a very low cover. There are Northern Lights. Thunder Rosa seems to be wrestling an almost perfect match so, so far. So far, so good for Thunder Rosa. And, and Taz, I agree with you going in. I had Tony Storm as a slight favorite, but a prognosticator could go out of business real quick. Betting against Thunder Rosa. The Casadora reversed with the roll through, and Thunder Rosa oh. the stomp. Well, the champion, you know, has got. Well, hold on here. Far leg hook deep. Champion's got to defend her title, right? So she knows her back's against the wall, and you can see the look in her eye. The wheels you know, turning. What, what do I got to do here to beat this girl? I mean, this really the toughest test of Thunder Rosa's reign thus far. She's. Yeah. Defended that title, that AEW Women's World Championship against the former champion, Nyla Rose. She's got a kind of a cross body right here. She can hook over that other arm. You see Tony Storm trying to maneuver yeah. her way to the ropes, and Thunder Rosa got her boot under the bottom rope. Great awareness by referee sure. Aubrey Edwards to call the break. That was a nice move. The liquid hips of Tony Storm allowed her to avoid. And with Tony's experience being a world traveler, as you guys pointed out, get knowing where that rope is is key, too, when you're in a hold. 
All you have to do is break the plane of the ropes. Tony Storm knows that, and now looking for the DDT. Thunder Rosa put on the brakes. Northern Lights suplex on the floor. A yeah, great counter by the champion with that release. Northern Lights, a late release, which is even a little tighter on. Let's take another look here. Yeah, I think we'll get a look at that late release. That's what this was. See right there, that little late release is, actually adds more impact to the landing. It's tough to do, though. Thunder Rosa. Oh! Ooh. Slow, to, slow to enter the ring. And Tony Storm just threw her shoulder into Rosa and knocked the champion to the floor. And now Tony Storm, she's fixing to take a big chance here, but oh, got caught. Uppercut by Thunder Rosa. And oh, no. Oh, no, no. What the hell's going to happen here? Thunder Rosa with Tony Storm. Tony's, Tony's got that top rope hooked. That's all that's saving her right now. You're right. Good observation. German. German suplex. Well, the problem with that is the apron is an extremely hard part of the ring. And when you do a German, oh, there it is. I was going to say, when you do a German, it affects your own skull when you hit that mat. Oh, but the apron is the, the DDT. On the outside. Yeah, watch, watch this impact here. Bam! And face first and head first. As we mentioned, those mats on the outside are there to prevent lacerations on moves just like that. Correct. It's a, it's a tighter mat. If you've been on, like, a, a high school wrestling mat or collegiate wrestling mat, that's what it's like. It's not that soft. It's actually very tight. And Tony Storm may be thinking hip attack here. Oh. Right on target! Brother! Yeah. Good gosh. Holy crap. Tony Storm, another DDT. She hangs on to Thunder Rosa. Champ right here, guys. One, two, no. Good stuff. Good stuff right there by Storm. That's okay. Let's take a look at this. Watch this driving hip attack here. Look at that. Bam. Oh. She tried. Thunder tried to stop it, but it was there was no, no yeah, stopping that. All it meant that her own hands hit her in the face. <laughs> exactly. With all of Tony Storm's fourth. Important now for Storm Taz to keep it in the ring. Yeah, correct? You're right, because you have the champion rocking. You got a chance to capture this title. Beat on her in the middle of the ring. Don't let her get outside the ring. Don't let Rosa get out the ring. Tony Storm bringing Thunder Rosa back towards center. Maybe looking for that Storm Zero. Nice. nice. Look at this quick Spike counter. Spike oh. driver, but yeah, the counter, Taz. Beautiful. And attack the arm, the left arm, like a flying arm bar, that running knee strike. Exactly where she wanted it, the point of the chin, now up on the shoulders. Thunder oh. Rosa, the Death oh. Valley driver, center of the ring. Well, this, this young lady here, Thunder Rosa, might be on the road to retaining her title. That was a nasty impact, Kevin. Look for the fire, Thunder driver. It's Thunder Rosa! Oh, planted! Might be the end of the match, guys. Thunder Rosa retain. No! How the hell did Storm kick out? Let's take a look here, guys. This is an insane impact. Look at Tony Storm's head. Oh, my God. I mean, I hate to, it's cliche, but she had a kick out on instant instinct. Thunder Rosa has successfully defended her AEW Women's World Championship against Nyla Rose, Serena Deeb, and Marina Shafir. But this is without a doubt her toughest defense yet. You're on a big stage, bright lights. I'm oh. thinking pins and needles are shooting down Tony Storm's arms yeah. after that Fire Thunder driver. I think you're right. And Tony Storm, you, yeah, you can see clutching her left arm to her body, but she captures the kick or captures the leg, sneaks underneath. German suplex! Well, Rosa tried to stop it, that's hence why she went to the side, but it was effective by that's, Storm. That's the powerful hips of Tony Storm. Sure, sure, sure. And she's looking for the Shoulder. Storm Zero, but couldn't get Thunder Rosa up for that spike pile driver. Goes in the arm. Oh! You saw Storm grab at her shoulder. She might have a labrum tear or a rotator cuff issue. That could happen, and we wouldn't know it. Oh, the final reckoning, a page out of oh, Dustin Rhodes' playbook! And it scores the win! The winner of this match, and still AEW Women's World Champion, Thunder Rosa! Well, I'm all for two. Today, we're going to show the AEW Just the Kai Champion, Thunder Rosa's Tenshin Shogun. I'm all for two, but look at this.
Like I said, we shouldn't go into business betting against Thunder Rosa. She gets it done You're and right. keeps her title. You are correct. And it just goes to show that influence of the natural. Dustin Rhodes adding an unexpected element to Thunder Rosa's game, and she was already extremely well-rounded, Taz. Yeah, no, no, for sure. I mean, that, that, get that help and assistance from a veteran, a legend like Dustin Rhodes, I think that little bit definitely helped her capture the victory. You see right here the respect amongst these two ladies. Rosa showing respect to the challenger. Tough, tough night right there for Tony Storm. Nothing to be ashamed of, though. Great match. The AEW Women's World Championship is on the line. Thunder Rosa looking to defend against the number one ranked oh. Miu Yamashita. Yamashita, who defeated Thunder Rosa in the Women's World Championship Eliminator match in Tokyo. Can she do the same here tonight in the United States? I think she's made a mistake. She being Yamashita has kind of let Thunder Rosa back into this. She did throughout the break. Yeah, definitely control. Yamashita had it, but now here comes the champ. Buffalo and Albany, New York, here we come. And now Thunder Rosa, Northern Lights suplex, one, two, no, Yamashita. And to, to your point, Yamashita was very deliberate during the break. Thunder Rosa would pull herself up. She'd let her pull herself up. I think, right. I think uh, the challenger has been very deliberate this whole match. But what that says to me is that she's very first in controlling the tempo. Well, and JR, to that point, we really haven't seen Yamashita rely on her karate background at all in this match. This has been almost a straight up wrestling uh -oh. match. Yamashita's up, though, oh, and there no. it is, to your point. That Thunder high round long. Kick, kick ahead. That's the difference maker, Taz. That's right, that flexibility you saw by Yamashita, that high round kick while Rosa was on the ropes. But Thunder Rosa, big elbow strike. The return of Brian Danielson next. That's right, live. Huge. Now Thunder Rosa and Yamashita trading, and Thunder Rosa blocks the Lariat attempt. Yamashita blocks it from Thunder Rosa, and oh! The heads might have clunked it. Oh, Street Bot heads oh, get nice clunked. She can kick, boy. Yeah, the roundhouse kick by Yamashita, but Thunder Rosa just a leaping kick. Uh -oh. And now Yamashita, though. That was great, man. Fall her into the ropes. And now Thunder Rosa, the Cazadora. And Yamashita, oh, Yamashita hangs on. Go for it, go for it. Oh, Charmin suplex. Shoulders are down. Whoa! So hard to do a suplex, a German like that, when you're that low on your opponent around the hips. Takes a lot of strength in your core and lower back. Great job by Yamashita right there. But an uh, excellent job on a kick out by Rosa. Watch out for that strike. Thunder Rosa, you can lose your title here. Boot to the midsection by Thunder Rosa, Yamashita. Stopped in her tracks. Thunder Rosa looking for that Fire Thunder driver. But these, these ladies having trouble uh, gaining momentum and building. Oh. That might do it right there to get it started. Good physical, very physical for the. Oh, oh you so lost oh. Him. The skull oh, kick. Have a new chip. Not not new chip. Oh, here. No. no, Thunder Rosa had to grab the ropes. Oh. Key word is had to grab the ropes. You're right. I'll tell you what, maybe she just got something over on Rosa, man. Maybe, maybe we're going to crown a new champ here. Miyu Yamashita coming into Worcester, Massachusetts and has the champ figuratively and literally on the ropes. Now Yamashita, well this is how the first match ended. Thunder Rosa countered the counter. What did Thunder learn out of that experience? And there's the roll up. One, two, Yamashita. There's the tilt, there's the tilt. There it is, two, she got it. No. Thunder Rosa able to kick out though. She learned from her lesson. Correct. Just shift your weight a little bit. A mouthpiece just went in here by Rosa, I believe. And I think she Thunder. put a mouthpiece. Oh, the <laughs> right right kick right. right to the head. I need a helmet. Over to the head. Hard and shots, man. Now the karate on display of Miyu Yamashita. She was looking for Crash Rabbit Heat, but Thunder Rosa. Nice high knee. Back to the second knee. Yamashita catches the knee. Caught, caught the knee. And now Miyu Yamashita. The kick caught Thunder Rosa a roundhouse. I don't think Yamashita was expecting that. I wasn't expecting that. Uh -oh. Right, Thunder Driver. Oh. Wow. That's it. Got to be it. Two, three, Thunder Rosa retains. It's Thunder Rosa time here tonight in Worcester. Now, winner of this match and still AEW Women's World Champion, Thunder Rosa. What a battle, guys. Yeah, I tell you, the face of Thunder Rosa after the pin said it all, didn't it? What a struggle she had to win. It was a war, but Thunder Rosa retains the AEW Women's World Championship. There's only one Thunder Rosa.
And a great win here tonight. A great show of respect. Yeah, mutual respect by both these ladies. Jamie Hayter, Thunder Rosa going to war for the AEW Women's World Championship. Rosa firing downhill with that elbow strike, but she's still on spaghetti legs. Damn. Well, a lot of hatred between these two ladies. Let's be honest. There's a lot of issues, and you're feeling it right now. Oh, God. This is... Th Thunder Rosa just running in with the elbow strike. This is a slugfest, guys. Hayter, the windup. That was a glancing blow. Didn't make solid contact, and Thunder Rosa taking advantage, Taz. Yeah, because Rosa did a quick slip, and now a Northern Lights suplex here. The cover. No, Hater explodes out. Well, that was a smart, quick slip of that one forearm shiver attempt by Hater. Rosa did that, then slipped right into the Northern Lights suplex. I, I like the kick out or the escape that time by Hater from the Northern Lights suplex, using her core strength, just whipping her body to her left. And, and now Jamie Hater. Trying to pull herself up with the assistance of the ropes. Thunder Rosa not going to allow Hater the chance. Oh, oh, God. Oh, what a drop kick. Damn, near kicked the head off. Holy God, man. Thunder Rosa like she was shot out of a cannon. And now Rosa up to the apron. Oh, God. Oh, the God. senton crushing Jamie Hater on yeah, the floor. And her head hit that mat. Jamie's head. Hit the floor hard, guys. Yeah, I'm that, telling you. That, that senton hit her high. You're right, Taz. Yep. And that's the thing. When you get hit high like that, it takes your feet out, and all of the your opponent's weight lands on the back of your own head. And not right. only that, the tailbone coming down on your forehead. Yeah. It's a, a two-for-one for Thunder Rosa. Good call. And Jamie Hayter on roller skates as Thunder Rosa to the top. Dive and cross body. One, two. No. Hayter again breaks free. What a battle here. You can Man. see uh, the champ's like, what more do I need to do? Yeah, this has been a tremendous performance in front of this fantastic crowd here in Grand Rapids, or Michigan, the Van Andel Arena. And, whoa, Jamie Hayter brings up Thunder Rosa. Rosa escapes. And now the O'Connor roll attempt. Sure for the O'Connor roll, but not there. Uh-oh. Oh, the backbreaker, the power of Hayter. Hit her up high on the shoulders that time with that backbreaker. Like, stomp the cover, and Thunder Rosa kicks out. I like that. A stomp in the midsection right before she tries the pin. There's a sense of urgency right now. Sheer oh, drop. Boy. Brain buster. Can she follow up? Jamie Hayter. Far leg hook. Do we have a new chip? No. Oh, boy. Dr. Britt Baker thought it was over. And yeah, so did I. Hayter had that little bit of a hesitation. You'll see here. Right here on top of the head, there was a slight hesitation on the cover attempt. By and, and I think it was all to do with that senton on the floor from Thunder Rosa. Yeah, yeah you're right. She's rocked, man. Hater's head's a little bit rocked. Jamie Hater wow. wrestling a very gutsy, very tough match against the champion. I promise you to find a more physical female professional wrestling match. <laughs> and Britt Baker now providing an assist once again. And Tony Storm seen enough. And Tony Storm and Britt Baker going at it, hammer and tongs on the outside. Oh! Whoa! whoa. <laughs> Kicked her right in the face. I see. It's my division. That's what she talks about so much. And oh, oh. Tony Storm, the DDT on the outside, plants Britt Baker. Hater, Hater's looking after. Be careful. Hater was shipping that chunk oh, the roll up. The, the feet on the shoulders. Thunder Rosa rolls through, two count again. Rosa up to her feet, the Cazadora. Oh, what oh, a head. Hater tried to counter. The legs are hooked, and no, just barely Thunder Rosa does it. A winner of this match, and still AEW Women's World Champion, Thunder Rosa. You're right, Hater tried to counter the Cazadora, you're right, and she landed on her head in the process and barely got the win was Rosa. A hell of a performance wow. by Jamie Hayter, but Thunder Rosa, here we the see head, it. Head, Watch head, the, yeah, head. the head, and that's a, what allowed Thunder Rosa to maintain the leverage and score the victory to successfully defend her AEW Women's World Championship. It's called Battle of the Belts, guys, and that was a battle for a belt. you damn right it was. And it continues tonight in our main event, the Ring of Honor World Championship coming up next. The following contest is set for one fall with a 20 minute time limit. We introduce it first from the Black Hills, Aquaton. 
24 wins by Abaddon here in AEW as they get to the ring. And their opponents are in the ring, Jasmine Allure. Jasmine Allure saw some competition last night as part of the Zero Hour final battle and obviously would love to take Abaddon down who has a ton of momentum coming in here. Been very impressive. Oh, oh my God! Since returning from injury and certainly got the attention of the TBS champion Julia Hart. What do you make of that? Well, Julia Hart has made her appearance many times at the end of Abaddon's matches. Last couple of times, as a matter of fact. Lights go out. Julia Hart almost holds the oh, holds the belt out for Abaddon to watch, look, and ponder. Abaddon loves to play that intimidation game, but. Julia Hart, not one to be intimidated. Yeah, I think intimidation is what Abaddon is all about. Look at this. Abaddon just absorbed that kick. Oh, roundhouse kick of her own. Abaddon hits the ropes. Oh! Man, Abaddon hits like a truck and seemingly is impervious to pain, Nigel. That is all she wrote, the Black Dahlia ends it for Abaddon. Winner this match, Abaddon. Abaddon secures the win, their 45th win here in AEW. You can't overlook those wins. Oh, oh, here we go. Here we go. You know what that means, or at least what it's meant the last couple of times. And a, Julia, and again. And once again, Julia taking that TBS championship, just dangling it out in front. Oh. Abaddon to look, ponder, cross the line, perhaps. Julia, 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 Julia. Oh. oh, wow. I don't know if Julia Hart expected that. Abaddon, and now Julia. Respond to Julian Abaddon going at it. And the referee for the match helping Jasmine Allure away. There's no referee here at all. Yeah. This is just a fight. Ooh. Abaddon comes across with a knee on the head of Julia Hart. And now Abaddon grabbing the TBS. Oh, boy. And they know what to do. Yes, they do. Hold on. Watch this. It's Sky Blue! Sky Blue has come out, I don't know, seemingly to the help of Julia Hart, I'm not sure. But now, Abaddon's attention turned. Oh, no! Wait a minute, wait a minute! Yes! And now, Sky Blue, along with Julia Hart, attacking Abaddon! I don't know if this is Sky Blue, I think this is Sky Black. First time that we have ever seen Sky Blue work together with Julia Hart. Remember, it was Julia Hart that put the black mist in her eye months ago. And that's what led to a bit of a personality change that we've seen from Sky Blue. And that's what it has to be. And now, wait, wait a minute, who had Thunder Rosa? Thunder Rosa's in the ring! What is she doing? She's not been in the ring since October. Oh! 22! Oh my God! The former AEW Women's World Champion comes in to help out Abaddon. And the fans here in Texas erupt for Thunder Rosa! Talking about an odd couple. And they chant, welcome back. How about that? And a very irate Julia Hart along with Sky Black, as you said, Nigel, from Sky Blue, walking away in anger. There, there's going to be hell to pay, but I don't know which side is going to pay more. I can't wait to see it, though. 
tremendous crowd on hand at the Frost Bank Center here in San Antonio. And you're live on collision. Tony, Kevin, Nigel, right now you see Thunder Rosa on your left trying to get her first action, trying to get the tag in. Oh, Abaddon bit kick. the arm of Julia Hart. And Julia Hart, now Julia Hart is incensed, as you can see, and Abaddon sends both down. But can Abaddon make a tag to Thunder Rosa, who is up on the bottom turnbuckle? Nobody's going to be able to stop Thunder Rosa from getting in, and this crowd is going to lose their ever loving minds. Here it is. Thunder Rosa returns and runs right through Julia Hart and Scott. And now, sets up Julia Hart. Uh-oh. Double oh, knees. We've seen that many, many times throughout her career. And now, looking over to Sky Blue, Thunder Rosa takes flight with a flying lariat once again. And the knees on Sky Blue. A flurry of offense from the fiery, combustible Thunder Rosa. They chant Thunder Rosa's name, 172 days, the women's world champ. Running drop kick that time. Sky Blue is reeling. Thunder Rosa picks her up. Northern Lights, one, two. No, and a two count. Julia Hart breaks it up. The champion there to break it up. Julia Hart with a smile on her face. What a moment here. The TBS champ and the former women's world champ. Face to face, Julia Hart sends her out, watch out oh. from behind Abaddon. Oh. oh, she ate a super kick that time. Big thrust kick. Oh. Thunder Rose up top, and now Sky Blue oh. got her. Oh, I like the new Sky Blue. Yeah, I, I agree. Color me impressed. She may try to, a, a little running power bomb here. Let's see if she can connect. Dangerous out of that corner. Uh, nope, had to drop her that time. Oh, and another thrust kick. This time from Sky Blue in the face of Thunder Rosa. Christmas has come early for Julia Hart in the form of her unlikely tag partner, Sky Blue. But you know she's got Abaddon on her mind. Julia Hart going up in her opponent's corner. Let's see if she has the opportunity to complete this. Let's see if Thunder Rosa can get out. Oh, she's going to get some help because here they come. It's Abaddon. Swing and a miss. And this is one of the places that Julia Hart's most comfortable. Hanging upside down. No. Oh, not that way, though. That wasn't comfortable for Sky Blue. Not at all. Her face hit the knees. And a pickup. Oh! The Tijuana bomb! It's over. Welcome back, Thunder Rosa. This match, the team of Avatar and Thunder Rosa. Julia Hart, the TBS champion, was tied in the corner and could do nothing. She returns to San Antonio, the place she won the world title. And get the win, TV with Abaddon, who in seven days will get a shot at Julia Hart in the TBS Championship. Not the best result for the TBS champion who wanted to dispense with one challenger instead. She might have another one somewhere down the line. Coming up next, everything is on the line in this Blue Link matchup. Action continues live tonight on Dynamite. Daly's place, oh. Jacksonville, Florida. Julia Hart, Sky Blue, Ruby Soho, and Soraya have controlled this match for the last few moments, but Willow Nightingale not out of this one yet, Tony. Yeah, and watch out. Harley Cameron's been circling the ring here. She's going to try to get involved as best she can, but whoa! Here comes the former TBS champ. Yeah, Statland is in. She's legal, and she is on fire. Yeah, Statlander, they're... Julia and Sky off the ropes and now concentrating her attack on Soraya. I think Soraya tried to turn inward, but Statlander just too powerful and plants Soraya down. Statlander, the cover, and Soraya will kick out. Barely, well, barely. Battle tested is Soraya. She's going to kick out of most moves for sure. She's been through it all. Remember Chris Statlander, she was TBS champion. 
That was until Julia Hart. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, wait. Now, hold on a second. Oh, man, they might be. This is like a quadruple something. Is it quadruple? Octuple. Exactly. Ah! A quadruple suplex. Eight women. Woo! Four go over the top. Four crashing down. You said octuple. I said quadruple. That was crazy. Fans loved it. Willow Nightingale, I think, was the advantage that time. As Soraya escaping the waist lock by Chris Statlander. As Sky Blue coming in, looking for Code Blue. Statlander able to shrug her off and... Oh, oh. Sky got nailed right there. Watch out from behind. Oh. Willow took her eyes off of Julia Hart. Now, Anna, the flatliner. Driving Julia down hard. Ruby Soho, the back heel trip. Big leaping knee strike. And Soraya comes in with a front kick. What a hard hitting eight woman tag match we got. Thunder Rosa on the outside. Legal, Chris legal. Statlander with Soraya and Anna Jay making the tag. She's legal, Anna Jay here. Nice German. Rolling German suplex by Chris Statlander. Soraya makes the tag out to Julia Hart. And at one point, Julia Hart and Anna Jay, they were best friends outside of the ring. But now that is not the case. They are bitter rivals, and they are teeing off on one another. Absolutely. Two of our young stars right here on the female roster looking great. And right now, Anna, Anna was looking, for, she was looking for the Queen Slayer there, but Sky Blue tagged in as Anna comes through with that kick. Takes Julia off her feet, oh. but... Sky Blue connects, and now Julia She's got on that the outside, and that Anna slips choke. free. The Queen Slayer is locked in. Going to tap out. Sky Blue taps out. I'll tell you what, right now, that's an impressive victory because Sky Blue has had a plethora of momentum as of late. Anna Jay getting the win right there on her was super impressive. Good job. Anna Jay locking in the Queen Slayer, getting the submission victory. And as you mentioned, Tess, Sky Blue, I mean, she last year was an incredible year. It was a career year for Sky Blue. Will 2024 be that career year for Anna Jay? I don't know, man. Julia Hart is giving Anna Jay a look, man. And Anna Jay looked right back at her. There's a lot of tension there. You can tell in the eyes of Julia towards Anna. Great start, though, for Anna. Great start. This match in the women's division of AEW is live on Collision on TNT. Tony Schiavone, Kevin Kelly, and Nigel McGuinness. It's Queen Amanada and Thunder Rosa's first, Whoa. first singles match in 17 months. Ooh! And wow. boy, she got caught that time. Just oh. listen. And that fire her up. She's firing back. Amanada's snapmared her over. Watch out! Oh! Oh, you can see it on the face of the former champ. Wow. R-E-C-E-I-P-T. -E Find out what it means to me. Wow. And a question mark kick that die, it appeared. Amanada. Looks like she may be going for a hip attack here, and that is exactly what she's done. Do you see Thunder Rose's head ricochet? Oh, oh she missed that time. Thunder Rosa moved out of the way. Back elbow. Thunder Rosa fighting from underneath here. But, buddy, she is striking with authority here on Queen Amanada. Thunder Rosa rolls out. Here she goes again. Oh, yeah. Brother. And now up on top. Oh, oh, with the knees. Well, you get caught in the corner against Thunder Rosa. We, we saw that during her title reign. You're in trouble. As soon as she got out of the way of the second charge by the Queen, Thunder Rosa's eyes lit up. There's another one of her running drop kicks. That time got her caught between the middle and bottom ropes. And now, Northern Lights one and two. Then think about how Thunder Rosa got the early advantage on Queen Aminata. It was a drop kick through the ropes to the outside. Oh. 
Thunder Rosa again. Ooh, yeah. Those are some serious back leg front kicks coming from Thunder Rosa. Well, Thunder Rosa, a former mixed martial artist, so she knows how to throw the strike. Yes, she does, and now back and forth. Good block that time by the Queen. That double blow of hers. Oh! That, that was a, watch out! It's an air raid crash! Yes, sir! One, two! Oh, wow. and Queen almost won it! She thought it was a three. She's looking back at Aubrey Edwards. That face says it all. Look at disbelief on the face of Aminata. Is she going to go for the double stomp? I do believe she is, Kevin. Good call. Let's, Let's see. Yeah. Oh, and I oh, think right. Thunder, Thunder Rose is going to even let her get up for Again, it. Again, it plays into Thunder Rosa's hands. Oh, pump kick. In the, the battle of ring positioning. In the center, Aminat has done great, but close to the ropes, Nigel. Well, the veteran experience has certainly paid off now as Thunder Rosa. Here we go, watch out. Oh, small package. Oh, wow. Tijuana Bob. The Tijuana Bob. Two, three. Winner of this match, Thunder Rosa. Well, on her way back, maybe. She's got a long road ahead, but she looked great in this one. Certainly a tough matchup for La Mera Mera. She will return to the graveyards of Tijuana. Boasted. I'm undeniable and unstoppable. Any champion can put on our side. All right. Live from Savannah, Georgia, AEW Dynamite, Thunder Rosa. Red Velvet, a slugfest breaking out here at the End Market Arena, Tony. Yes, sir. And now Thunder Rosa sees an opening here because, whoa! because Red Velvet was dangling up against the turnbuckles. Oh! Rosa driving the knees into Red Velvet. Velvet stumbling out of the corner against that bottom rope. We've seen Thunder Rosa use this drop kick in the past, right. and she connects with it. So maybe throw another lights. Another light suplex, too, and... Velvet able to break free. Thunder Rosa. You see, favoring that left arm of hers. Now watch. Red Velvet, and during picture in picture, Taz had a pretty tight lock on that left arm of Thunder she Rosa. Did. She had that double wrist lock on Rosa with the legs in to wear down the arm of Rosa. Oh, right, there's, there's the those hands, yeah. yeah. And the quickness got her, got her right to the hands, Taz. Yeah. Not just body shot after body shot as Red Velvet gets reversed to the ropes. Thunder Rosa. No, nope. Velvet looking for the Cazador, the roll through. And oh, the oh, stop to the midsection. Oh, 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 God. Oh, brother. That will get your small intestine to protrude right out of your mouth. And Velvet thinking it's time to stir it up. The knees in the back of the head. Thunder Rosa, you can see very dazed. Look at how her head is drooping as Velvet coming off the middle rope looking for that bulldog. No, lands on her feet. As Thunder Rosa goes underneath. The fireman's carry on Velvet. Velvet, though, fighting down, firing down with those elbow strikes. Ooh, big boot to the midsection. And Double, now, she's going underhooks here. Double underhook. Velvet trying to bridge down, but... Oh, wait. A reversal there. Roll through. Shotgun drop kick. Yeah, Thunder Rosa got all of that. And now, Thunder Rosa could be the end. The double underhooks are locked in. And now, Thunder Rosa, a cover, two, and three. No one in this match. Thunder Rosa. Well, she calls the, that the Tijuana bomb, I do believe, guys, and have won it. Where is my time? Thunder Rosa, two for two since her return. And I believe she just may have called out Tony Storm. There we see in the head. Hey, Savannah so Bananas. Savannah Bananas got that awesome baseball team, man. Shivani, have you seen these guys? Uh, Shivani left. I'll tell you later, Shivani. <laughs>
got to look out of a puzzle. Savannah uh, Bananas, they're real funny. They really should check them out on the, the YouTube show. The action continues live on Dynamite. We are sold out here in Toronto. I'm Excalibur, joined by Tony Schiavone and Taz. And right now, Thunder whoa, Rosa whoa, whoa, whoa. heading to the top, taking out Mariah May and the EW Women's World Champion. You don't see that much. You don't see that much out of your opponent's corner off the top. And right. now she makes the tag, Schiavone, to Deanna. That's a good call, Taz. You don't see that many, many times. Deanna Perazzo could do so many great things in the ring. Look at this. Deanna, the knee lift. So smooth and fluent, rush and leg sweep. Maintaining control of the wrist, looking for that Fujiwara armbar. Maybe even the Venus de Milo where she captures oh, both oh, arms. Oh, <laughs> Knock her block oh, off. Oh, man. Kidding. One, two, and. Mariah got a, got a face full of foot that time, didn't she? Lordy. And Thunder Rosa firing up this crowd in Toronto. Oh. Mariah. Fights her way free of the grip of Deanna Perrazzo. Nice counter to this, trying to get that on bar. Deanna really looking for that Venus de Milo as the boot up and now. Oh, wait. Oh, I'm not sure Deanna was happy about that tag by Thunder Rosa. Whoa! Watch the champion. Drop it, and now the champion goes down. Yeah, well, Thunder Rosa is still the legal lady in the ring here, isn't she? Thunder Rosa and all oh, that headbutt on target by Mariah May. Thunder Rosa. Now with Mariah Sellers, driver center of the ring. That was high on the back of the head. Oh, wait. Uh -oh. Time, timeless Tony Storm. German suplex. Low arc on that one. Thunder Rosa landing hard. She snapped into that very quick, explosive throw. And now Storm knows she's got Thunder Rosa sitting ready for something. And I think I know what it is. Right. That crazy face thing. It's a close up. Yeah, give it. Uh, <laughs> And oh wait, the, those Jack the, the City, the pot driver counter. Oh! Wow! No, How about that? Santino Diana Perazzo and Thunder Rosa. Rosa, right there, not playing around, just got a victory over over the champion, timeless Tony Storm. I mean, Thunder Rosa absorbed that hip attack and had the presence of the mind, from the mind to counter the pile driver attempted. Wow. Deanna Perazzo is not happy at all. At all. She should be up team one. What the hell's going on over here? Thunder Rosa swooping in for the victory. Fans remember our Dynamite main event, the I Quit match for the TNT Championship. Christian Cage and Adam Copeland. And immediately following Dynamite right here on TBS, it is one hour of Rampage. Oh, yeah. The AEW World Championship, or World Tag Team Championship Tournament continues. Kotsuguri Shibata will be in action. Takeshka and Rocky Romero. Plus, the main event street fight, Chris Statlander, Willow Nightingale versus Sky Blue, and the TBS champion, Julia Hart. So much more action still to come live tonight from Toronto.